Hey, this is David, and uh, I am the the maker and the architect of the philosopher's staff, also of the lore keeper, which is uh, akin to or similar to a shaman stick or a uh, uh, talking stick uh, that my ancestors, the Native Americans, used to use. Now, you can see I'm not full Native American blood. I've got a lot of Irish and Scottish in me, but uh, Walla Walla and the uh, Umatilla tribes are where I primarily have my ancestry from as far as Native American goes, uh, and also some of the Nez Perce or Nez Perce tribe. I uh, just want to talk about the sacredness of plants. I'm going to uh, post a link for an article uh, that the Japanese have shown that plants communicate with each other. Now, I feel that uh, all things are connected, all living beings. In fact, I think that not only is the earth, but also the rocks and the minerals, things that we normally think are as inanimate, are alive as well. Just my personal belief, uh, but more so for the plants. And so uh, when I go out and harvest any of my wood or anything out in nature, I try to leave a gift. A lot of the Native Americans uh, suggest and have in the past left things like tobacco. I don't use tobacco myself. I don't carry tobacco around with me. Uh, but something else you can leave is um, a song and and a little blessing. And so that's what I try to do. It doesn't happen all the time. I don't always do it. Sometimes I'm in too much of a rush in this darn world that uh, makes us keep going so fast. But I always try and I teach my children to leave something in return, uh, to ask permission to take the plant, whether it's a grass, uh, whether it's a, a tree, or whether it's some, some bark, uh, whether it's a plant uh, that I'm going to carve spoons from, or whittle spoons from, or uh, make cordage from. I always try to leave something in return, and I thank that plant for giving itself up for me. I try not to waste whatever it is. So that's just a little something I want to share with you today. Uh, if you do happen to get one of my lore keeper uh, artifacts, which is a talking stick, or if you uh, get a philosopher's staff, just realize that uh, not only when I uh, take those away from the outdoors, but also when I, uh, throughout the process of making that, I talk to them and I leave a gift and I thank them for what they're giving us in return. Yeah, it's kind of far out there for some people, right? But uh, I feel I feel good about it. Uh, plants are cognizant in their way, just because we can't uh, aren't aware of what's going on and, and we can't see that or hear that, they can. And I really feel like the spirit that is left with the song can also touch that plant and spirit. I do believe that they were put there for our use, but we need to be not only wise, but grateful for that. Thanks for watching.